All right, 70 or 62 is long division. I'm going to do 62 and 65. 62 looks like this. X to the fifth minus 1, all divided by X minus 1. If you write this out, it might be better to add in your placeholders. I know it seems tedious, but it's going to prevent you from making mistakes when you set up your generic rectangles all over x minus 1. Alright, so we have our box. Alright, we know that our box is going to have six columns. We always do one more. So there's six columns. We can go ahead and split this in half. Okay. There's our six columns. I'm going to erase this to give myself some room. Now we know that this is x minus 1. And we know that our first term is x to the fifth. It'll go here. Now from here, we're just going to kind of work backwards. So we know that x to the fourth times x is x to the fifth minus x to the fourth. So it results. Now we need to make, so we've done x to the fifth. We need to make 0 x to the fourth. The only way we can do that is to put an x to the fourth. We'll cancel. This will be x to the third minus x to the third. x to the third will go here to make it 0x to the third. So now we have x squared. Probably noticing a pattern here. This will be positive x squared. Again, we need to get 0. So we get x, negative x. This will be positive x. We should probably check these off. And here we are. Um, for this, keep going with it. We'll be adding 1. This will give you negative 1. And then our last step, we need to make negative 1. We already have it. We have 0, meaning this is your remainder. Um, which is none, and then your final answer, put in our pluses, is this. With no remainder, which means it's factorable. Okay, so that's 62. 65, I'm going to do right below. 65 is a really good problem. It's completing the square, so it gives you y equals 2x squared minus 8x plus 7, and it's going to ask you to complete the square. You know, the tricky thing about this, I didn't talk about this in classes, you cannot complete the square when a is bigger than 1. So we're going to see what we're going to do with that. Before we do anything, subtract 7. y minus 7 equals 2x squared minus 8x. Okay, how do we get, how do we deal with this 2? Well, what we're going to do is we're going to pull out a 2 here. By pulling out a 2, now we're able to have x squared minus 8x plus blank. And we can think of our 2 as being on the sidelines. So um, now we're just dealing with a being 1. We can complete the square there. Now what we do here, we also need to do the other side. So we have y minus 7 plus blank. Okay. So we'll complete the square. Half of 8. Oops. So let's do... For this, it's negative 8 over 2 squared, which gives us 16. So we're going to add 16. You will also add 16 here. Now, it's problematic about that. All right, so now that we do this, um, here's where students are going to make a mistake. If you look at it, if you think about this 2, this 2 is actually going to be distributed by the 16, so we're actually going to get 32. That's not balanced unless we do the same thing to the other side. So we need to multiply this 16 by 2 also to keep it balanced. Now, we can go ahead and work this out. 32 minus 7 is 25. And then 2, we have x minus 4 squared. Um, did I make a mistake here? Let's see. You know what? I totally made a mistake. My mistake's right here. 
So we're going to go back and we're going to fix this real quick. That's what happens when you're so focused and in the zone. All right, so wait, 2, we didn't factor this right. It's minus 4x, which means we're actually... We're actually taking negative 4, dividing it by 2, and then squaring it, which gives us 4. So we are adding 4 to this. And we're adding 4 here. There, it comes out better. So now we have 1 here, and we have x minus 2 here. To finish up, subtract 1 from each side, and we get as final answer y equals 2, x minus 2 squared minus 1. We can um, go ahead and identify our shifts. We're going 2 to the right, down 1, and your stretch factor is 2. We can go ahead and sketch that parabola. All right, so that's 65. Biggest, biggest thing here is make sure you are pulling out these twos um, to keep it balanced.